guys can see my hair is getting longer like the growth is coming through i am a year and it will yeah okay i'm a year and seven months in oh my gosh i'm a year and seven months in oh my gosh i am growing out my sides like my sides are flourishing to the point where i can actually comb comb my hair i can twist my hair and possibly someone can probably cornrow my hair hi youtube i'm back with another video and happy new year it is 2018 and i would just like to welcome new blessings new relationships with people better relationships with people your family friends your jobs um whatever it is that you're doing and i just want to welcome that to you guys and also myself as you guys can notice i have dyed my hair i've dyed it last week and i dyed it myself and it's supposed to be like a a magenta pink color a little bit more of a hot pink my hair is more dyed um blonde but you guys already know how my hair is already dyed so i just applied the color onto that i did not dye i did not bleach my hair any more other than what i already did and I just applied the color on it. I also inserted a clip of the box of the dye that I use, and it's just a basic rinse. No harm done. Um, that's pretty much it because it's just color. It's not like I bleached my hair. I just added the color on top of my already bleached hair. Um, as well as I did do another retwist on my hair. I retwisted my hair last week as well, and. The last time I did retwist my hair was about two and a half months ago and this was a little before I got sick the first time but I am back feeling much much better. Well I will be producing a little bit more videos um, catered towards this on um, my channel and it's going to be a little bit more art more art videos, art related videos pretty much. Um, um, I want to incorporate a little bit more of that on my channel. And so you guys, you know, can see like my models um, who I work with, just a little bit of that for you. Um, I'm in the process of creating a lot more things. That two and a half months, I kind of needed that break just to realize like I needed to know what I really want to do as far as like my art and what kind of like path I want to go down. I already knew the path I want to go down last year but it need to be a little bit more concrete as far as I need to actually set some foundations again and pretty much like re like start over and revamp some things for myself and with that being said I am doing a lot 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 more things like every day I at least try to like do five things catered towards my art even if I still have to go to work I still gotta put in the work so if I can work for someone else then I can work for myself which is something I always told myself a few years back when I did start doing this. And so far, so good, successful, doing that and whatnot. Um, I'm not sure what I, guys want to know as far as like either you're here for my hair or you're just here for my art or you're just here in general just, you know, supporting what I'm doing. And I really appreciate you guys for that. During the time that I was sick, because it was just like a long overdue process of me not getting better it just also gave me like a little <clears throat> realization that I was kind of going back and forth with myself whether like as far as with my hair with my art with like okay I wasn't feeling my hair I'm like uh it's not the fact that I want to cut my hair it's just I wanted something new and I just didn't know what to do I was going to add another um some more extensions to it as far as I did um, add like like twists, like using kinkies with hair, but that was in October, the week before Halloween. I did that, but I took it out because it just was too much hair at the moment. And as well as it was just contemplation between whether, what could I do with my hair? And I just wasn't like satisfied with my hair at the time. But it was just me not really, you know, vamping up my look overall. And it was just nothing but a mind process of me looking at other people's hair and just telling myself that 
it's your hair it is what it is I have control over what I do to my hair and I have control over what I put in my body to actually you know see the overall look of my hair as well so I do have 100% control over that and as far as like with my art I wasn't like really satisfied with my art either I'm like okay I like what I'm doing I love my doing I'm not gonna downplay myself cuz I know how to draw I know how to paint I know how to like take pictures really well but it's just to the point where comparing and I had to learn how to stop doing that so this time around I am again devoting more time and stay more busy to try to get more things done with my art and for myself so I can really get this ball going. I also have been contemplating doing something very drastic and it's taking a risk but I'm not going to tell you guys that risk yet because I am in the process of working on that and I don't want to put something out there and someone might you know wish some bad stuff on it. I'm, I'm not here for that. So I'm just going to keep it to myself up until the time being and let you guys know. Um, oh, also, 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 my mom, I got a few more things for my mom. She did send me another sweater, but it's in my closet right now. But she did send me this box of goodies. And I think you guys are going to like, hold on, I'll be back. So here's Shippo. He was sleeping in my, in my lap. So my mom, she is working on a few t-shirt designs and she is, yeah, she is killing it. So Da Vinci and Dummy Artist K. So I thought that was pretty dope that my mom is doing this for, for me and as well as she's learning a new gift. She has also made me leg warmers and I just really love the colors. Oh my gosh. Like, as much as I try to be very monochromatic with what I wear, there are times and where I do go back to my old self and start wearing my colors like this. And I really love the colors because it's neutral and I just love it because it reminds me of Pippi Longstockings. That's what I told my mom. She has made me another scarf. This scarf is it's, it's pretty long. It's pretty It's not a cow. Like the pink one. The pink one is, is my favorite. But I got another favorite one. And yeah, this one, like I said, this is pretty long. This is almost my arm length. This when it's folded in half. And also and another hat with the palm on it. My mom, she do make her own palms. And I wear my, my hats every day. Like I am not playing any games going out into this cold weather freezing my butt off for lastly she made me some hand warmers and i call these hobo hand warmers the only reason i call them hobo hand warmers is because for one they don't have like the, you see well in the movies i used to watch especially home alone like well the bandits they had like gloves like this and hobos and like in the 90s movies they had gloves like this too but I had to go get some actual gloves to put on my hands and I thought these were cute so I really love the yarn selection my mom she is really good at choosing the best yarn and the yarn to actually feel good on your skin if you guys have any questions um, just leave them down in the comment section below also if you guys like have any goals or any any new goals like monthly goals, weekly goals, either for your hair or for whatever it is that you're doing for the year of 2018, then you know just leave them down in the comment section below. I would love to hear about them and we also, you know, communicate back and forth with that. Also, if you haven't already subscribed, like, and you know, come on now, just you know, if you already watched enough of my videos, just come on and subscribe and stuff like it really amazes me that you guys are still watching my videos and that's like really a milestone that I have like conquered and you know just getting out of my like shy girl comfort zone just you know just push me out there just a little bit more and stuff so I really I really appreciate you guys for being here and supporting that and you know giving me that boost of confidence that I have long yearned and needed for myself and that does start with the self first and 
and I'm here and I'm really enjoying this process that I have put for myself and I really appreciate you guys, appreciate you guys for being here as well um, but I will talk to you guys in another video